Welcome, my name's Sam. Here's your 10 minute mobility workout. Max and I are going to show you. So it's all standing. If you just pull those tummy muscles in. Welcome to your Halloween hit workout. Make sure your hips, your knees, and your um, belly buttons are pulled in. Think at all. I'll show you the moves as we go along. And movements, little combinations for you. So lift those arms to the front. So I go up. And a squeeze open, closing down. So you're squeezing the shoulder blades together. You're moving the arms, just mobilizing those shoulders. I'm going to move on and I'm going to lean over to one side and then the other side. So keep the weight equally weighted in your right and left foot. Add those moves together. I go up and open. And then I lean over. One to one side, one to the other. Go again. Goes up and open. Leaning over. So it's just moving and mobilising the spine, mobilising the shoulders. Take a ten second rest in four, three, two, and one. And relax. So we'll move on to the next one. So we've got nine more. We're going to move Exercise to the side. I'm going to get you to pretend you're going to sit in a chair. So you sit the bum backwards. And that's called the back cross. Then you pull the tummy muscles in. So you're flexing the spine and you roll up. You're then going to reach up, look up. And circle round. So let's put it together. So you sink down. You roll. You reach. And you circle round. Yep. Sink down, bend those knees, stick the bum out, then tuck the tailbone under. Reach up and circle around. So it's a lovely movement to release the spine. Try and get as much flexion through the spine on the way up as you can. Sit down and all the way up. Reach, look up and circle around. Let's go one more. Reach up. And separate. I'm going to do a little bit for the feet. So I'm going to point the toe. Yeah. Pause. So you stand in one, one leg. Swing it round. Touch it to the front. Touch it to the back. And bring your feet together. And change legs. So it's point. Swing it round. Touch it to the front. Touch it to the back. And feet together. Yeah. So we swing it round. Touch to the front. Touch to the back, as far back as you can. So swing it round to the front, to the back, and change. So what we're doing here is just mobilising the hips, activating the core muscles because you haven't a balance on one leg. If you need to hold on, you can hold on. Swing it round, touch to the front, touch to the back. Good. Let's just pause there. Feet are parallel. I'll show you the next one. So you're going to take your hands, you're going to rotate around the corner. Good. On the right, then reach up twice, and then do it to the left. Reach up twice, reach, and reach. Twist. So your belly button points forward, your hips point forwards. So it's to get your thoracic spine, that's the upper back, moving, as well as the shoulders. Stretching up. So that's making you use your muscles and mobilize through the spine. Reach. Can you see my elbows tuck in when I reach up? So they open out. Reach up. Well done. Okay, let's move on to the next one. So what I'm going to do is take the hands behind on the back of the hips and I'm going to squeeze and release. So I'm squeezing the shoulder blades together and keeping the tummy pulled in and squeeze and release, squeeze and release, squeeze. And then I'm going to circle my right elbow, circle and circle. Back behind, give me four squeezes. Three, two, last one, circle right, circle those shoulders, any crunching, 
squeeze twice circle to the right left squeeze back so I'm squeezing one and then I'm doing back stroke there's one and two so lots of mob mobilizing the shoulders okay take this feet a little bit wider we're going to keep the legs straight pull the tummy muscles in I'm going to turn the toes out and I'm just going to wiggle from right to left. So it's a wiggle. It's moving that pelvis. There's four. Three, two and one. Now camp the centre and I just do a little plea. Just a little one. Keep your back straight. A little plea. Push those knees out. Let those muscles stretch. Come back to the centre. Wiggle. Four. Three. Two one clear down in the center for two wiggle for four one two three four a little bit rib isolation there one so my rib cage stays still go down and up down and up okay I'm gonna come now you can hold on if you want for the second part of this one i just want to think feet and ankles so you're going to lift one heel up, put it down, then the other heel. You want to try and keep the weight in the centre. So you're just walking through the feet. And you're coming up on the tiptoe. Yep. That's non-weight bearing. So if you want to make that a little bit harder, you come up on the tiptoes and you walk through. So you want to keep that pelvis nice and still. Think tall. Think up, up, up. Can we keep it going for the 50 seconds? So we're past halfway. It's about 15 seconds left. And it's good for mobilizing and also strengthening the arms. And relax. Okay, I'm going to continue with that where we calf stretch. Exercise so I've got a split stance. Just weight in both feet. You can go a little bit wider. So if you're not on a tight rope, take it a little bit wider. Lift up that back heel. It's lift. Push it down. A lift. So we're going to float the arms up and down. So you're getting a little calf stretch. Also mobilising again with the ankles. Lift. do it to halfway, halfway and then we'll change legs so let's turn around to the other side a lift lower everybody can benefit from a calf stretch that sun is shining you lift squeeze that heel down try it without the arms if you're unsure and relax. Now, what I'm going to do is I'm going to go back to the beginning exercise and add the first two exercises together. So it's up and open. It's up and open. Lean over. Lean. Good. Now do your back release. You sink back. You flex. You reach up and you circle round. So that's a wee flow. Yep, it's up and open. And lean over. Then a sit back, sink down, and round the spine, and reach up and circle. So I'll show you closer. It goes up and open. And lean over. A sit back. And I round that spine. I reach up and breathe and circle. Okay, the last one I'm going to go with the legs. So I'm in the sand, but you'll be able to see me. So you go round in a circle for your right leg and then front back. So it goes front, round, touch to the front, touch to the back, and bring the feet together, change legs. So it's there, right the way round. And that's moving all our joints in our hips. Okay, and then rotate. Reach up twice, stretch, rotate the opposite way. Come halfway there. All the way up, reach. 
Can we go a little bit quicker with the circles? Circle, front, back, and change. Front, back. Bring the feet together. Reach up twice. We take the opposite way. And come back to the start. I hope you enjoyed those 10 minutes.